Good evening. They might have done quite a bit of refurbishment work on this stadium in recent seasons, but it still has a refreshingly old-fashioned quality about it. We're at Anfield. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And this has all the makings of a highly engrossing match. It is Liverpool taking on Real Madrid. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joe Gomez in central oh, defence. he's in behind them here, Derek. Well, it was down to whether or not he could beat the keeper, and that question has been answered. Well, I'm all for players striking through the back of the ball with power, but he has to hit the target from there. Explosive attacking qualities can be so important, look no further than Mo Salah. Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Oh, that is a superb save. A corner from Modric. And clearing it away. Salah. Luis Diaz. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? Good bit of pressing. He has time to play it over. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Karim Benzema. High quality defending. Benzema! And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Henderson. Now Mo Salah. Salah. The cutback, excellent save from Thibaut Courtois. The high press was very much on. Defensive efficiency personified. Now that's a super ball over the top. He just needs to stay level-headed now. Well, we like to call things as we see them, Stuart, and I must say he's got that one horribly wrong. Well, it's a poor decision in the end. It's way off target. Fabinho can he put it away well that takes the wind out of their sails great defending this might be ideal for the counter can they take advantage of the situation able to get a body in the way moving the ball forward with purpose Mane just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, a second goal for them here. Salah. Well, as the stats confirm, Liverpool had the lion's share of the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I oh, wait a minute. They could be in here. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. 
So back underway, and Liverpool really galloping to victory now. Modric. Clean challenge. It is advantage Liverpool here. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Course. Rodrigo. Luka Modric. He's blocked it. Liverpool have given it away. Course. Now Casemiro. Modric. Benzema. Liverpool have it once again. Is it going to be? And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius Jr. Here's Modric. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Well, opting for the short corner. Course. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Just couldn't capitalize there. Andrej. No more time left. First half is over. Here. And away they go again. Just reflecting on what we saw in the first 45. Joyous football from Liverpool. Vinicius Junior and options in the center Virgil van Dijk with the block another block really getting stuck in defensively that's what you call defending from the front possibilities here on a pass that lacks quality and with that the attack fizzles out Liverpool have given it away. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. And return to Modric. Defensive efficiency personified. Now can they create something? He's in position. Surely. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Modric, Benzema, Casemiro, the ball with Luka Modric, has a go, and the attempt just wide, so unfortunate. An effective challenge, course. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch pass was absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. 
Room to manoeuvre on the wing. And crossed in the direction of the back post. Please stay in the game's reception if you've lost your keys. And that's an important intervention. Won it back. Nice switch of play. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Substitution for Liverpool. Mane. Number 14. Oxlade Chamberlain. Coming onto the pitch. An alert piece of defending. Modric. Is with Vinicius Junior. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Can he get one back? Oh, another one for them! And with plenty of time still remaining, this game is very much back on! Well, how about this? 4-3. Can they hit on the break? Beautifully disguised ball. Not all that convincing defensively. And Salah! Saved but still a chance. Fabinho. Well, that save could be the turning point here because they've been second best all over the pitch up to now. Magnificent challenge to win it back. A triple substitution from Real Madrid, something you don't see too often. 15 minutes left for play. And Carvajal untidy in possession there. Difficult to stop him. Perhaps an opportunity for Isco. And a goal! And this says everything about guts and determination having been down by four goals. Goals. Wild celebrations. Number 22. Well, you don't get too many score lines like this one. 4-4. Four, four. What can Real do from this position? On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? Keita. Putting his body on the line. And Mohamed Salah now. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Benzema. Oh, it's astonishing! One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. It is advantage Liverpool here. But he's decided that no advantage was forthcoming, really. And so it's a free kick. Won it back.
Well, this game is almost over. Not quite yet. Real Madrid still with a bit of work to do. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen from them? Well, what a game this has been. Some of their attacking play has been absolutely brilliant. And there's been some great individual performances as well. But they've been far too open to the counter-attack. And that's why they're still clinging on here. Real Madrid have given us away. Breaking at pace. And he's in an offside position. Using space on the opposite flank now. And good pressure high up the pitch. Pressing high to win the ball. Carvajal. Now with Benzema. It looks promising. And in! Oh yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, as you can see, the skill to set up this chance is absolutely brilliant. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also... Well, that pass easy on the eye. Oh, how about that for a chip? Savour it! Pure brilliance! Moving the ball forward with purpose. Mane 